Hey guys, it's Shadow Knight Paladin. And it's been a while since you heard me, didn't it? So, three weeks have passed since I last put out a video. And the last video I put out was for Inktober. And that is a voiceless video. Because when I put that video out, I didn't have a voice at all. Like, talking would just be a pain. It, it physically hurt to talk. So I decided to just put it out, word, uh, voiceless. And I explained in the video that came before that that I was sick. I'm still sick, as you can see here. And it's one of the reasons why I wasn't able to complete Inktober. So I'll be talking about why I wasn't able to complete Inktober, where have I been, and why it's okay to fail. This might get cut up into several videos, depending on how much footage I have to cover this topic. But let's go at it slowly. I can't really talk fast either today because my nose is clogged. So let's get into it. The video in the background are going to be Inktober pieces and I'll talk more about that later on. So, where have I been? In the past three weeks, I've been sick. That's pretty much all I've been doing. Um, I got sick for two weeks with a cough which you heard during one of my Inktober videos that I started coughing and like my voice was kind of dead, so that was the start of it, and it was pretty bad. Two weeks is a really long recovery time for me. Usually when I get sick with any kind of sickness, it takes me approximately a week at most. So two weeks is kind of, it's a strong virus if it's two weeks. And at the end of the second week, I was starting to get well, I had some voice again, It my throat didn't hurt anymore. I said that I had some mucus in my chest, which I was expelling, so I was on the road to recovery. And I guess things just happened to pile up, and then I got exposed to a cold this time, and I got a cold. Now I have a cold right now, and it sort of like joined forces with the cough that I still had, so I got sick again. And so right now, as of recording, this is the third week that I've been sick. So I went to a doctor, uh, I got some antibiotics among other medications to try and arrest it. I might need to go back in today for a second round of medicines because it's not gone. The antibiotics should have been able to like wipe this out, but it didn't. So here I am, stuck with the, go with the cold still. It's a bit of a hassle to be honest. It's so annoying to deal with. So yeah. So since I've been sick, I've been focusing on recovery for the most part and trying to be productive with work at the same time. But I've been so dead. Like, my energy is almost constantly low. And for the people who know me, you know me, I'm kind of like, I'm pretty, and I'm not like bouncing all over the place, but I'm somewhat energetic. So... Having no energy is really tiring for me because like I couldn't be active or just moving around a lot costs a lot of energy and I'd be breathless a lot of the time so it's really tough but yeah let's hope the let's hope this ends soon because it's kind of tough especially since for reason number two work has been pretty busy it's during the Christmas season so we're ramping up our operations, and there's a lot to do. And we have seven. We have we had a Halloween party which we had to prepare for, so that also took up some amount of time. Which was, it was fun though. The Halloween party was just, like super fun. We got to dress up. I dressed up as an elf, or I tried to dress up as an elf rather. But at the same time, there's a lot more work than usual, so. I spend a lot of time completing my tasks, even when I'm at home, and I really didn't have any time or energy to do Inktober anymore, which sucks because drawing is my hobby, but I had to prioritize just finishing my work and then going straight to bed. For the past three weeks, that is more or less my routine. I actually go out to buy groceries or food. But other than that, I haven't really been doing anything like for hobbies, except for sometimes playing mobile games, but really, 
That's really nothing. I haven't been able to do my laundry even. I'm that bad right now. <laughs> so, I didn't have time. Or energy for that matter. And that segues to our third. Or the third reason. And probably the primary reason. I wasn't able to complete it over. <laughs> so, for those who are following my Instagram, you would know that at the very start of Inktober, I was already struggling keeping up. Around day 4, 5, 6, I started to lag behind. And then after that, I would start posting more combined posts or posts. I would post like three pictures in a day because I had to catch up. And that kind of sucks because last year, I did it every day. Given that my circumstances were a bit different last year. When I, did, when I did October last year, I didn't have a job yet, so I had a lot of free time. And I was really head in the game, focused on October. I was focused on drawing, I was starting to build up my YouTube channel. Which to say, at this point, my YouTube channel is approximately a year and three months old right now. Um, as of when I started posting actively. So yay, hi, welcome. Thanks for staying if you've been there since the start. And. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah. When I went into Inktober this year, um, I wasn't 100% into it. I was like, what, maybe 70% into it? So, it's not that surprising that I failed. And. It's also to say that if it's something that's just a personal hobby. It's a bit tough to get into a project that you're not 100% into. And a lot of people, not just artists, even businessmen have talked about this, that it's not good to get into something half-heartedly. And sadly for October, I came into it rather half-heartedly. Oh man, I'm running out of footage. Okay, so let's continue this in the next video. I'll... I'll just link back to this video if ever. And in the next video, we'll talk about Inktober, why I failed, a bit more in depth into that, and a little bit of pep talk, maybe. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I'll try to start posting regularly again. I might even post a bonus video in between, but we'll see. And I'll see you around.